What do you like playing in your, your final game at Austin? Um, I was thinking it'd be a fun time. You know, we're going to um, go out there and play hard. You know, I'm trying to play as hard as I can. Um, it is the last time, so it might be a little emotional, kind of, probably not. Is there any games or moments that stand out to you of your four years here? Um, Arizona State, of course, but uh, Michigan State was fun, even though we lost. That was a really fun game to play in. Uh, yeah, now they, they've, they've been talking a lot. Um, so after last year, um, we definitely got to get back, you know what I mean? Um, so yeah, so it's, it's a, little, a little extra motivation going around right now. Um, we're just trying to practice as hard as we can and, you know, um, do as best as we can on Saturday. What does it mean to you to get that win last week to get you to a bowl game in your senior season? Um, that was fun. It was uh, good. It was a good win, a good team win for us. You know, we, we were all feeling really good after the game and, you know, just to be able to get to go bowling this year, so it's it's fun. It's cool. You had a couple of passes defense, and you passed Efo Epre Olmu for full fourth all time in Oregon. What does that mean to you, especially considered when you came in, he was kind of the veteran leader of that group? Yeah, um, I mean, it's a special moment for me to pass him, but I mean, the fact that he had that many and still had interceptions, so you know, you still got to tip your hat to Ugo. I mean, to Efo, of course. You feel like you're gonna get that interception this week in the Civil War? That'd be great. That'd be great. Last game in Austin was good. Uh, last game in Austin and to get a pick. Um, that'd be that'd be fun. Have the comments made it into the locker room about the rain jackets from last Civil War and you guys putting them on and they knew they had you at that point? I mean, it was cold. It was cold and it was rain. Like it was cold. Uh, I mean, his comments. You know, it, it just sounds like the guy is hating on the guy who gets all the girls. You know, but you know, you can't never hate on the guy who gets all the girls. It just makes the girls like him more. Like you just, just you can't do that. It just never works out in your favor. Um, but sure, you know, uh, that happened. It happened. We can't deny that it happened. But uh, it was cold though. So I mean, we probably won't see no rain jackets this year because you know. But yeah. So there is a little more to this rivalry. You guys are. You guys are. Feeling the, uh, I mean, obviously last year happened, and now they're talking about it. Yeah, I mean, it's just we got to respond to it. You know, we're not going to respond in like through this way. You know, we just handle that out there on the field. But yeah, we definitely got to have a little response to it. Do you get mad at your hands every once in a while? I, I always see you grab your helmet after all those past events. Yeah, I mean, like when the ball comes, it's like an, like I get really excited. I'm like, oh god, here it comes here. And then I drop it. Then I get really depressed. And then I'm like, oh, next play. So it's an, you know, it's an emotional roller coaster, but um, yeah, I really get down on myself after I drop those, but because uh, I should catch them. But um, yeah. Thanksgiving, Thanks, Thanksgiving coming up tomorrow. Uh, you have something in particular to look forward to the most when you sit down for dinner? No, I haven't had a real Thanksgiving since I've been here, so um, I'll be at home chilling.